Trevor's over there flat track and I can see nobody's talking to him. I'm trying to get out the view of those other people. If they're gonna see me or not. They just spotted me. I've been spotted. So it's all good. Darn it. Hopefully they I put them, I hit them too many places. They're not gonna be able to find them all. There's no way. There's no way they're gonna find them all. They are, they're looking at me. I've been spotted. I've been spotted. All right, all right. Secret agent, run. Trevor, Trevor, I've been spotted. They, they spotted. Trevor can't see me. All right, all right, hold on. Casual, casual, just play it cool. Walk over and talk to me. Are they following me, Trevor? They're watching me? I think we should go. Unless you want to go talk to them. You want to go talk to them about the cosmology? I don't know. What do you think? Let's go talk to them. Okay. They're looking at us. They're watching us put flyers on all the cars. We should stop doing the flyers. <laughs> stop doing the flyers because they're going to know that we flyered all the cars. Okay. I just put them away. All Let's right. see how they're all gathering out in front of the church. Yeah. Let's go talk to them. All right. Yeah. I got so many, and I hit them in the rear view mirror. I tucked them in the rear view mirror. Yeah. You want to do the talking? I'll let you do the talking because you're more mellow than I am. More what? You're more mellow. Just ask questions. Hey, how are you? Morning, brothers. Got some questions about scripture. Are we all Bible believers? We're in church, brother. That's why they see us. We're always in church. The word church means the people. That's what we're doing. Cool. That's what we're doing too. Church. Okay, what are you looking in cars for? Uh, not looking in them, actually. Um, just want to give you one of these. The Bible teaches that the earth is immovable, fixed. Brother, we're, it's Christ on pillars. we're Christians, and we appreciate that. Me too. Uh, and, uh, okay. and Jesus did say, if you don't understand the earthly things, what did he say? How could you understand the what? We understand the scripture. Yeah. You want to come on in and sit down? With You're welcome to join us. I really appreciate that, guys. We were just here for a mission. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, so could we ask you questions about the Bible? No. no uh, it, you know, we're here as, as uh, Bible-believing Christians, and we... Uh, the Bible says be able uh, to give an account. You listen to me. We can give an account, and we reach out, and we take the gospel all over the world. And I don't need to go into your church. Uh, there are people outside of your church that needs to hear about it. And that's where you need to be, is finding those people that are not in church, those people that don't believe so, in the Bible. So Bible believers who are being lied to in schools don't need to know the truth about cosmology? Uh, yeah, I know God created the universe, and he's still creating the universe. Uh, but I don't... What do you mean by he's still creating the universe? The Bible says... Because it God, says it was completed on day six. No, it, it, the Bible says that, it's straight, that the universe is that God stretched it out. And uh, God's ways are not my ways, and God's understanding is not your understanding. His ways and are he, higher. And, it, and he created the earth, the universe. Who knows what he's doing out there? But I don't want to debate it with you, brother. Stay I don't up. want to debate either. I just wanted to ask questions about Scripture, and you won't allow me to ask any questions. Look, i got a preacher in there preaching, and we're listening. Now, you can sit down and listen, or I, my suggestion well, but is... Well, maybe I was came here to talk to you guys. No, maybe you need to go, uh, as I said, find some Maybe you need to go. Know. Maybe I should stay and talk to you guys. I... Uh, turn That's your, what I want to do. Turn your recorder off and move on. I just or want to ask some questions about Scripture. The Bible says, be able to give an account. The Bible says, uh, listen, test all things. Uh, read these lips. Don't touch me, sir. Read okay? Me, you don't have your right to put your hands on me, okay? Well, you you're, don't, you're, you're, you're barking orders at me. All I want I'm to do is ask questions. Orders. I'm just telling you, you can come join us or you can leave the church property. I have joined you. I'm here right now. You can leave the church property. Do you understand? Just take a flyer. You okay. got 
Shit. Cool. God stopped the sun in Joshua to yeah. stop the day, correct? We don't need you filming things, buddy. I need it. I need it as evidence for how the pastors react to biblical cosmology because I find it truly disheartening that this is how Christians respond to someone that simply wants to ask questions about Scripture. Uh, well, that means you understand more than everybody else. No, no, no. I'm not saying that, but I'm here to ask questions. I want to know what you understand about it. It's not a matter of what I understand. My relationship between me and Jesus Christ. And the it, Bible and, says and, be able to give an account for everything you believe. So can I ask you one question? I, I, one I, question, and then I'll leave. Do you believe God made a spinning ball earth in infinite space? Yes, yes or no? Yes. So why would you believe that? Because God's word tells me that. Now, See this, this right here? God's word says nothing about a spinning ball. Give me one verse. Just... In the beginning, Give God me. created the heavens and the earth. This is the earth. Fair yes. Tom, he created everything on Nothing it. about that proves it's a ball. Look, I, don't, what I know that verse by heart. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. You're the earth was without, yeah. but brother, I the don't earth know was what. without form and void. Where's your Bible? And the, the darkness Bible? moved over. I had it memorized. No, no, darkness don't. moved over the deep, and the Spirit of God moved over the face of the waters. And God said, let there be light, and there was light. And God separated the light from the day, and the light he called day, and the darkness he called night. Come on, guys. Yeah. You're joking. You're Go. joking right now. No, you are. Go. <laughs> now you're barking orders. You said you weren't barking orders. No, at me. you're sitting here barking orders. I'm not. I said, I've can I a, ask you I've a had question? I've enough of your stuff that you're spewing out. Anything, Trevor, to add? The firmament. God said, let there be a firmament in the midst of the waters. It's firm, solid, something solid above our heads that we can't get outside of. So no space. Fellas, if I ever need you, I'll call you. You don't have my yeah, number. Got, what's my phone it. number? I got it memorized. You you got, what's you my phone it. number if you have it memorized? Yeah. Listen. You Quit being want. smart, Alec. You're no. being a smart Alec saying you got my number and got it memorized. What a again. joke, bro. I'll, You're lying. I'll, You're lying through your teeth. And everyone just saw you lie. And we're all supposed to be Christians. And we're supposed to stand up for the truth. So you and you, sir, are bearing right false witness. You are tacky. That's a sin in front of the Father in heaven. You okay? Don't, you don't know. Sin. What? Sin. It's all right. You're and, forgiven, right? And, and we're, we're all forgiven. We're standing up for the firmament because the, oh, the listen, heavens declare the glory of God. The heavens if, if, if the firmament me, shows us. I'm no, not attacking no, you. We haven't attacked you at all. We haven't attacked you guys at all. Service going on out there. I, now go. go. We haven't attacked you, and we're not bothering the service. You don't have your right to touch me, okay? I got all the right. No, you don't. Call the police if you want. You don't have the right to touch me. You're the police. Let me see your badge. Are you lying again? Are you lying through your teeth? This guy is just lying through his teeth, dude. You're not the police, though. You just lied. Are you impersonating a cop? Call the police. This guy's impersonating a cop. Call, Trevor, call the police. This guy's a person. See how it works? You see how that works? got a policeman inside. But you're not a cop, and you just said you're a policeman. You're lying through your teeth. You don't have my number. You can't call me if you need me. I don't want to call you. Got you. Okay. And you can't give an account for what you believe either. Well... I, With one scripture. You can't give me one scripture. For God so loved the world, he gave his only son, that whoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life. And that, I believe in him. I've got everlasting but life. But that has nothing that to do with now creation, my man. Who cares about creation? The Bible says if you don't understand the earthly things. Get off this property. Get off the property. So no, go. You don't have the right to put your hands on me. That's assault. I got, I got it on video. No, it's not assault. Now, just, you have the right to touch me? By law? Just, what do you mean you have not touched me? You just pushed me. How can you say you did not touch me, but you pushed me? No, that's you guys create a problem. I just came to ask questions. The service is going on. I know, and we're not bugging. If you get loud, we're not bugging you. If you get louder, this guy's putting his hands on me. You made him do it. I didn't make him do anything. That's a joke. That's some liberal nonsense. Oh, you made me attack you. You guys joking? That's freaking. Yes, I live on Earth. No. Do no, I don't live at the church. You, do you, this no. is not my home. <laughs> calm down. What's this guy's putting his hands on me. Okay. Sorry. That's fine. Yeah. Just calm down. We're very calm. I, I, I love your time. I want to know uh, who you are. What, cool. What so my name's, my name's Nathan Thompson. Nathan I run the largest. Thompson. I run the largest flat earth group in the world. And so Jesus said, if you don't understand the earthly things, how will you understand the heavenly things? Okay. And this gentleman here is trying to tell me that none of that matters and that we're, we're saved and that's all we need to focus on. And I'm saying all... So you know all, the best way. 
No, I'm saying all truth no. matters. No, we all have all opinion. truth matters. Jesus is the way. Jesus is the way, yeah, the truth, I, and the life. And those who worship Him will worship way. Him in spirit right, and in truth. truth. If we could agree that we're brothers, we love each other. So, so stop the commotion out here. There's no commotion out here, guys. Stop. Yes, there is. You guys commotion. are the ones pushing me. We just came to ask you, questions. But we don't want your questions. We don't want your questions. Well, that's fine. So y'all move you know? on. Well, just fine. Move on. Cool. Okay. Yeah. God bless you guys. Okay. God bless you. Could I leave you with a flyer? Could you just take a flyer? Keep going. Cool. 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 I feel led to go ahead and tell you guys. I'm Trevor. I'm Aaron's brother. Yeah. And uh, I'm gonna pray for you guys. Okay. Uh, it got under my you. skin that I was told not to talk about flat Earth at a certain event, and I don't I know what flat decided, Earth is because oh, that's where we live. So that's where we live. You no, can test yeah. it. Well, uh, the, when you the say the earth, of the earth, guys, stop it. You're the one who said the earth's stop not flat. It. I don't want the, the Why would you make that claim? The conversation is over. Why would you make that claim? Uh, because, because with I, what evidence? Just the Bible says, here. be able to give an account for anything you get believe. Get out of here. It's more, more, more orders, dude. Away. This is how you're, globe earthers act in public. No, look. Circle. The earth is a circle, which is a flat shape. Yeah. Okay. The earth's flat. Now you're happy. Go. Sweet. Praise God. Another right. one bites the it's dust. Flat. It, flat. it goes, it goes. It, it flat. And it's you know, not flat moving flat. either. It's yeah. not moving. No, so we're not just, spinning. It, and God didn't create it. So y'all move on. No, God did create it. You just said in the beginning God created the heavens yeah. and the earth. Yeah. Man. Come on. I you enough, you can roll. I'm not here to cause yeah, problems yeah, yeah. with your it's service. Time for you to move on. It's all right. Come so on. have Come you ever have you, Of course. Have you ever met a biblical earther? Someone who believes real cosmology? Has this ever occurred to you that this is a real thing? Or? I have, have heard what you're saying. Okay, great. Uh, personally, I believe the earth is round. So I'm not here to talk about beliefs. I know. Okay? okay, we can test the floor scientifically. Okay. We observe it as a linear field, a linear geometric plane of existence. Right. It has no downward curvature. So if we lived on a ball, it would be doing this in all directions, right? Right? Balls do this, they have curvature if, in all directions. But God put it in an orbit. Whoa, 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 whoa. God says God it's immovable. So how could he put it in an orbit and say it's immovable? You smile. You smile because you know the scriptures. That's what he says. It's on foundations. And he says... Where, where are you parked? We're over here. Over here. Where? In the, in the corner over there in the red van. Red van. Red van. Red van. Okay. Kind of hard to miss. But he did say it's immovable. It's on pillars, on foundations. Okay. It will, he says it will never move. Right. And if you're Satan and you're the father of lies, hypothetically, I'm just your brother in Christ. <laughs> okay. Sorry, I didn't mean to put my hand. No. But you're brother in Christ, right? And, right. and, and the devil is the father of lies. So, yes. and, the, and the Bible says, test all things right. and hold fast to that which is true. Yeah. So you came out and said, I believe this. And I'm saying, yo, your Bible that we believe in is telling us to test all things. And this right. gentleman over there is telling us, oh, it's a ball. It's in space. Well, he not, hasn't tested any of that. Well, he didn't have one scripture to support we that are, either. We all, we all believe different things, and, and, uh, and you have a, your right to your opinion, and I'm not going to tell you that it's wrong. I'm not going to say that I'm right or I'm wrong or whatever. <laughs> but uh, Well, God bless you for just I mean, being I'm cordial, the, you know, because we were cordial, and he's to barking orders and, and pushing me off the premises. <laughs> you know, well, we, you know we're all... What happened in Texas, we're all on a little edge here, you know, about, you know, somebody we see that uh, maybe uh, come in that we don't know. So yep. Yeah, yeah, but I'm a brother, just so you guys know. I, I, I love, the, I, I love I, the church. I love yeah. the Bible. We yeah. didn't come to cause any harm. I know. Okay. You know, and right. so uh, we came to just raise awareness. That's all okay. we were doing is raising awareness. Right. Uh, and so you're looking sharp, by the way, and you're really cordial. Can I get your first name? Cause Donnie. Donnie, Nathan. Yeah. Nathan. It's a pleasure to meet, someone. Trevor, meet, Trevor. Pleasure to meet right. someone. Pleasure to meet someone that's got a real heart for yeah, other well, brothers, not, you know? Yeah, well, he does. He's just... He, he just well, the lead. thing is, the Bible says raise kids up in the way you want them to be, and then and they'll follow that path. But if yeah. you get raised for 60, 70 years believing a lie, then your ego, yeah. it, you become emotionally attached to the lie. Right. And and that doesn't make it right. That doesn't make it true. Yeah. But it's just an emotional response. I get that all the time, my man. I've done this ten thousand times, yeah. and it's always the same thing. Where are you based? I mean, I you, keep it moving. You I keep, moved. I was in Dallas yesterday. Dallas. Yes, okay. sir. Okay. I did a debate wow. over there. You've been the, a long way. <laughs> the video already has ten thousand views. I did a debate, and it was the exact same thing there. Just guys yelling at me, pointing in my face, calling me names. So there's nothing new under the sun. The truth will be attacked. At first, it'll be violently opposed and ridiculed, right? Yeah, and then yeah. it'll be mocked, yeah. and then it'll become self-evident. Okay. All right. Uh, I'm 
I'm sorry if we were. You guys are awesome. God bless you. It's all good. Oh, it's too hot. Hold on one second, guys. Thanks for your super chat. I really appreciate it. We got 101 people watching. Now. 101. Yeah. Holy. Guys, that was amazing. Trevor, I love how you went into the firmament immediately. That was beautiful, dude. Thanks, bro. And there's no way they're not even trying to take the flyers. So all these cars got flat smacked. Those guys got the truth. They didn't have any good arguments scripturally or scientifically. They live on a globe. And I'd say all in all, that was excellent. We did a pretty I good job. I hope God was glorified, you know? I really do. My dipshit. All right, five-year-old. No, you told me to fuck off. You said I'm a dipshit. Yeah. Why? Fuck off. I Hello, this guy is a flat earther. Because I gave you a flyer? Fuck off. I just gave you a flyer. Are you serious? Yeah, I Are am you very serious. You're that upset I gave you a flyer? But hey, you said the earth flat or round. Why can't it be flat and round? Welcome to earth. You think you're spinning? You think earth spins a thousand miles an hour? Hey dude, you have to leave. I have shit to do. I actually don't have to leave, by the way. Just so you know. You have to step aside and let me do my... I don't have to step aside, just so you know. Ah! <laughs> that was beautiful. I know, I'm a beautiful person. Your who believes. Like shit. Oh, okay, that's great. Yeah. Who believes? We're gonna talk about beliefs. We're gonna go into cult rhetoric. Tell me about your religious beliefs. What do you religiously believe? Tell me about your Breathe in that bad breath. This is our globe heads right here. This is how they act in public. Tell me about what you yeah, believe. Yeah, this is, this is definitely how I act in public with people who accost me at a grocery store. I gave you a flyer. Trying to get my groceries. I gave you a flyer. And then you called me a jackass and told me to fuck off. That is exactly what I did. Yeah. That so, is exactly what so I did. So I didn't accost you. You called me names and insulted me. And I gave you a flyer. And I'm free to do that. Just yeah. like you're free to do what you're doing. You're right. You're spitting all over the place. Just so you know. Okay, that's yeah. fine. While you're talking, spit is flying out of your mouth. Yeah, exactly. That's yeah. That's great. It's pretty disgusting. Yes, I'm the disgusting one. Thank you. Yeah, I just gave you a flyer. That was all. Thank you. Oh. See you later, Globehead. This guy, dude. I couldn't believe him. I had to whip out my phone and start recording it because it was absolutely ridiculous that people act like this in public. Oh, yeah. Because someone tried to give him a flyer. Yes. He said, you're a jackass and fuck off. Yeah. Yes, I did. Yeah, you did. It's my freedom in this you're country. Right. Yeah, you're right. You're also free to think you live on a spinning ball. Yes, I'm yeah. definitely free to think and that. And you don't have to have any good arguments. You can believe it with no good arguments. 